Life is not what we are chasing. Life is what we are leaving behind the chasing, says the father. Wishes didn't come true when you chased after a star. Observe the behavior of the butterfly and chase no one, for they will only elude you. Happiness doesn't have to be chased. It merely has to be chosen, says the father. Comment yes if you believe in God and do help support us through Super Chat or watching this video completely. Chasing a person doesn't give you value or build values in you. You earn your value by chasing morality and practicing dignity. Once we get the things we are striving for, we rarely remain satisfied with them. The things are just the bait. Chasing after them forces us to evolve and it the evolution and not the rewards themselves that matters to us and to those around us. This means that for the most people success in struggling and evolving as effectively as possible, says the father. But before moving into what even may get happen, father has a special message to share with you. Someone is, cha someone is chasing you with an iron sword, seeking to end your life. The sun is scorching and fear grips your heart as you run through the barren deserts, desperately seeking refuge. Your body is weary and your spirit is weary. In this moment of distress, you cry out to the heavens, O Lord, deliver me from my pursuer. Suddenly a gust of wind sweeps through the desert, carrying the scent of hope and salvation. You follow the guiding breeze and find yourself at the entrance of a cave hidden with the rocky cliffs. With no other choice, you enter, seeking shelter from your relentless pursuer. Inside the cave, darkness envelops you and you sink to your knees, uttering fervent prayers for protection. In the midst of your supplication, you hear a voice, gentle yet commanding, whispering to your troubled soul. Fear not, my child, for I am with you. Take courage and trust in me. Encouraged by the divine assurance, you rise to your feet and continue deeper into the cave. Guided solely by the flickering light of a small candle in your hand, as you progress, you notice a narrow passageway barely visible amidst the darkness. A profound sense of curiosity tugs at your spirit, compelling to you to explore farther. Cautiously, you navigate the treacherous path, your heart pounding with anticipation. Soon, you reach an opening and step out onto a hidden ledge overlooking a vast canyon. The beauty and magnificence of the paranormal before you momentarily suspend your fear and despair. In this moment of tranquility, the voice of the Almighty resonates within your being once more. My child, you have been persuaded not by the sword of flesh and blood, but by the chains of fear and doubt. Remember that even in the darkest of times, I am your refuge, your fortress, and your deliverer. Suddenly a figure emerges from the shadows, clad in radiant armor and whirling a flaming sword. It is an angelic being sent by the Most High Himself. With a resolute gaze, the celestial warrior confronts your pursuer, driving him back with each strike of a divine weapon. The unfolding battle serves as a metaphor for the struggles we encounter in life. The pursuer represents the trials and tribulations we face in life, whether they be external threats or internal struggles. 
The cave symbolizes the need for us to seek refuge in the presence of God to find solace and strength in His embrace. The hidden passageway represents the journey of faith where we must trust in the Lord and venture into the unknown, even when darkness surrounds us. Ultimately, the angelic warrior signifies the divine intervention that comes to our aid when we turn to God wholeheartedly. The Father says today that no matter how fierce the enemy may seem, with God on our side we can face our fears with unwavering faith and emerge victorious. As you witness the perseverant retreat before the heavenly might, you are filled with a renewed sense of hope and confidence. You understand that in God's presence there is refuge from every storm and in His strength you can overcome any adversary. With gratitude in your heart, you descend from the ledge and continue on your journey, fortified by the knowledge that the Lord will never forsake you. Trust in God, seek refuge in Him, and you shall find deliverance and triumph in the face of adversity. Embrace the pursuit of God's kingdom and you shall find the treasure of a fulfilled and purposeful existence, free from fleeting temptations of the world. Now, this raises an important question, what will you do with this revelation? Your guardian angels have gone out of their way to share this celestial message with you. Could it be a sign that you're stepping into a new, even more impactful chapter of your own journey? And if so, are you ready for it? You've already accomplished so much just by being you, but this could be the universe's way of preparing you for even greater things. If you've listened to this message and felt a resonance know that it's no mere coincidence. The universe doesn't make mistakes. Every step you've taken and every challenge you've faced has led you to become this inspiring figure. Isn't it incredible how life's puzzle pieces fit together to create this amazing picture? Others, too, are poised to be touched by your radiant energy as you continue on your journey. May your guardian angels guide you towards endless opportunities to shine even brighter. Now listen to this prayer as it holds divine blessings and essence. O oh Lord, as I lift my voice to you in prayer, I am awestruck by your majesty and the magnificence of your creation. From the vastness of the cosmos to the intricate beauty of the smallest living beings, your handiwork is evident everywhere I look. I stand in awe of your power and wisdom, and I am humbled by the privilege of being in your presence. Heavenly Father, I am aware of the challenges and adversities that surround us in this world. The enemies of our souls seek to undermine our faith, disrupt our lives, and lead us away from your loving embrace. I implore you, Lord, to shield us from these malevolent forces, to place a hedge of protection around us, and to grant us the strength to stand firm in the face of adversity. Guard our hearts, minds, and spirits against the schemes of the enemy, and let your light dispel all darkness. Father, I long for spiritual progress and growth in my journey with you. As I traverse the path of faith, I yearn for a deeper relationship with you, a greater understanding of your word, and a heart that overflows with love for you and for others. May your Holy Spirit be my constant guide, illuminating the scriptures and revealing the profound truths contained within. Grant me the wisdom to discern your will and the courage to follow it. Lord, your word tells us that if anyone lacks wisdom, they should ask you, the generous giver, and it will be given to them. I come before you now, seeking the precious gift of wisdom. In a world filled with noise and confusion, help me to discern your voice amidst the clamor. Grant me the wisdom to make choices that align with your will and that lead me closer to your perfect plan for my life. Heavenly Father, 
in a world marked by turmoil and unrest, I earnestly seek your peace and serenity. Let your presence be a calming balm to my weary soul and grant me the strength to remain steadfast in my faith. May your peace, which surpasses all understanding, guard my heart and mind in Christ Jesus. In the midst of life's storms, help me to find solace in your abiding love. Lord, your word assures us that you are a lamp to our feet and a light to our path. I beseech you for guidance and direction in every aspect of my life. Lead me in the way that is pleasing to you and reveal your divine purpose for my existence. Illuminate the path before me and grant me the courage to follow it, trusting in your unfailing guidance. Father, there are times when life's challenges seem insurmountable and my strength falters. In those moments, I turn to you, the source of all strength and endurance. Fill me with your might and let your grace be sufficient for me. Help me to soar on wings like eagles, to run and not grow weary, to walk and not faint. May I find renewed strength in you each day. Lord, you are the great healer, capable of mending broken hearts, bodies, and spirits. I lift up to you those who are in need of your healing touch. Whether the ailment is physical, emotional, or spiritual, I trust in your power to bring about restoration and wholeness. May your healing hand be upon those who suffer, bringing comfort, relief, and renewed vitality. Heavenly Father, I am acutely aware of my imperfections and my need for your forgiveness and grace. I come before you with a contrite heart, confessing my sins and shortcomings. I ask for your mercy to wash over me, cleansing me from all unrighteousness. Grant me the ability to extend forgiveness to others as I have received it from you. Lord, you are the provider of all our needs and your storehouses are never empty. I place before you my concerns and needs, trusting in your abundant provision. Whether it is material, emotional, or spiritual, I trust in your faithfulness to supply all that is required. May your blessings overflow in my life and in the lives of those I love. Father, I yearn for the fruits of the Spirit to flourish within me, love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. May these attributes be evident in my interactions with others, reflecting your divine nature and drawing people closer to you. Transform my character, Lord, and make me a vessel of your love. Heavenly Father, your word encourages us to live in unity and harmony with one another. I lift up to you our relationships, both within our families and among our friends and communities. May the bonds of love and fellowship be strengthened, and may your peace reign in our hearts. Let our interactions be marked by grace, compassion, and understanding. Lord, your heart aches for the lost and the broken, and so does mine. I lift up to you those who have not yet experienced the transformative power of your love. May your spirit draw them near, open their hearts to your truth, and bring them into your fold. Use me as an instrument of your love, that I may share your gospel and be a beacon of hope to those in need. Father, in a world that often clamors for more, I pray for a heart of gratitude and contentment. Help me to recognize and appreciate the countless blessings that surround me each day. May I find joy in the simple pleasures of life and contentment in your presence, knowing that you are the source of true fulfillment. Lord, I join my prayers with those who seek the peace of Jerusalem, a city that holds immense significance in your divine plan. I pray for the safety and well-being of its inhabitants and for the resolution of conflicts that persist in the region. May your peace, 
which transcends all understanding, extend to the land where your chosen people dwell. Heavenly Father, I recognize the allure of temptation and the frailty of human nature. I beseech you to deliver me from the snares of temptation and to grant me the strength to resist its enticements. Let your word be a lamp to my feet, guiding me.